That's what I'm saying. The DA is going to be there tomorrow. So, we have to figure out the last minute things for Monday's meeting. Monday, you know, May 20th. Got here real quick. Um, and that's the third meeting in our community meeting series, Police Interactions um, with the Community. So, and we got the DA for this one. And um, Ivy Morris is going to participate again, the president of the CPRB. And of course, the chief is going to be there. I don't know who, what other command staff he's going to bring, but he's definitely going to be there. We've got, we've got a little outline. We're going to do some discussion about... Um, some of the findings right. from the previous two forums that we held on police interactions that brought community members together. Right. We got some really good input with some tangible solutions that we're hoping to continue flushing out. Absolutely. It's going to be all about uh, taking what we have and hopefully turning those into concrete, implementable things that community members and the department can work on collaboratively to begin to implement. Right. And, you know, I think the last two were really good. People, like, really, they came out, they said their, they spoke up, they spoke out, and they offered options. Like, it was real, like, community discussion. I think Monday's going to be another opportunity to do that. I, I want to make sure we keep, like, the beginning part pretty brief, because I don't want to take that away from the community. And I think that the addition of the, the district attorney is really important. Like he's got to be part of this conversation. We're trying to get all people to the table. Right. Community members from all across Albany, the police department, yeah. all the way up from you know command and executive staff down to uh, neighborhood officers and the guys on the street and right. the cars. I think it's like the only way that we that we can get we can ensure that the police department meets the the expectations of the community. Um, like and this is in, it's in an accessible, inclusive space within Arbor Hill at the Arbor Hill Community Center. So people are able to get there, it's after work. And so it's also, you know, I think a safe, welcoming environment. Yeah, um, a neutral welcoming. environment, which is most important. Mm -hmm. It's not at the police department. It's not at some, at some intimidating place. Right.